Windows 10 has a new mode called Continuum Mode, but before I show you that, I actually wanted to just show you how you switch between desktop and metro on, say, my, uh, my Surface uh, Pro 3, or even like a device like the Lenovo Yoga. So it works for hybrid devices. Uh, now, regularly, you have to use your Windows icon, either uh, where the start menu is going to be, or on screen, or the charm bar, things like that, to actually switch between Metro as well as the desktop. Um, and that's how it's done on Windows 8.1. But in Windows 10, it's actually different. They've done something completely different in making it easier to switch and actually run full Windows on a tablet as well as a hybrid device. So looking at the demo Microsoft setup, you can see there, this is Surface Pro 3 with the keyboard attached. Clicking on the Start menu, we're gonna go to the Mail app, which will open up in as a Metro app. So you can see it there, it looks like a full Metro app. And uh, once you detach the keyboard, now you get a prompt that says, go to tablet mode. You click on that, say yes, it now basically blows up the whole thing as a full Metro app, but you still have your uh, regular desktop icons at the bottom and the whole desktop features. You click on your start menu again, and this is what the start menu now looks like in tablet mode. And you can go open up, um, you know, OneNote. We can now decide to draw something on there if we choose to, uh, make some scribbles, do whatever you want to do with different applications. And you have that there, but you can see, of course, the app is open as well as the mail app is open. Here in the start menu, this is the new layout. But this is a very cool thing. Once you connect the keyboard back and click switch back to desktop mode, it just shrinks down. So that start menu basically expands out in tablet mode and basically shrinks back down in desktop mode. So really, the start menu is the Metro UI shrunk into the start menu. That's really what it is because you can expand the start menu at the very bottom of your desktop or not. So it all depends on how you want to look at it in Windows uh, 10. Continuum mode will not be available in the technical preview that comes out on October 1st, but we hope to see it in the consumer preview. So thank you very much, guys, and always enjoy your entertainment.